everyone. Welcome to Good Taste. I'm Tangie Patton here on the beautiful San Antonio Riverwalk on a beautiful day. And I'm with Chef Byron Bergeron with the Fig Tree, an incredible restaurant destination right on the Riverwalk. Thank Best you. patio. Oh, love it. And we're making a delicious dish, kind of a twist on the traditional escargot, right? Absolutely. What we're doing is a, a Basquez style escargot. We're going to saute a little butter with some shallots and garlic. And we don't want to brown it too much, just a light toast on it. And wake up the flavor. Yep. Make sure it's completely cooked through and translucent. So you don't want that hot garlic taste. So we're going to toast a little fresh pepper in the pan. Season with a little bit of salt. And we're going to deglaze with our uh, rosé. And you can use any any wine, really. I just like, yeah. I think using the rosé, it's kind of got a Mediterranean aspect to this Basquez dish. Then we're gonna add some cream. So we're gonna take this, we're gonna reduce this down until we get a fairly thick sauce. Okay, now we're gonna add a little ground up chorizo, which really has a wonderful smoky unami flavor. This is a dried Spanish chorizo, a little bit different than what we're used to here in San Antonio. And then we're just gonna let this cream reduce. So now that the sauce is almost reduced, we're gonna pour in our escargot, because we wanna heat them up very gently. We don't want to overcook them and make mush. Now we're gonna add some parsley, some diced tomato, and we're gonna finish the sauce with a little bit of lemon juice. Mm. Really pretty. Okay, there you have it. The beautiful Mediterranean dish, of course with the Mediterranean wine. Absolutely. With the Masla Dame from uh, Provence, a little rosé. A little dry rosé, beautiful. I've got to taste this. Ooh. Oh, I love that chorizo. That is fabulous. And I have to ask you, because I'm always curious what knife chefs use. You had one here that I could tell. Right. It was yeah, a big this, deal. Yeah, this is probably my favorite knife. It's a uh, Kikuchi Swedish steel. It's uh, made in Japan, and it's basically a hand-hammered, folded steel, kind of like they used to make samurai swords. Yeah. So if technique. we have that knife, will we cook like you? Uh, sure. <laughs> We're trying. Byron, thank Absolutely. you so much. Thank you.